That's right, ladies and gentlemen. We find out who the winner is of the wonderful, wonderful Conor McGregor paintings tonight. Live on the MMA holes. That's right, everybody, let's dance. Because we have two winners, and it is wonderful, wonderful. Two Conor McGregor paintings coming up live on the M. M.A. Holes, yes, that's right. Tickle your penises and vaginas. Da 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 da. Sexy time. Who's ready in the chat? Let me know right now. What's going on, friends and family? I hope everybody is wonderful, 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 wonderful. John, a little louder. Wonderful, wonderful. That's good. How's everyone today? I feel like I haven't seen you in a year, but I did. I saw you earlier today on a swole. I got a tattoo, but it's a little bloody and runny. It's all gross right now. Give it a couple of days. In four days, I could take this off and it'll be all healed. Well, it won't be healed up, but it'll look a little better than this. It's a bloody mess right now, but that's fine. I have an MMA holes tattoo. I have it over here on the mic. I have it up in the corner over there. I have it everywhere. I have it on my shirt. MMA holes for fucking life. That's right. Let's see who we got here. Are you guys pumped up? Because we're going to have a winner. We have two winners tonight of some swole paintings. Sexy paintings. And it is wonderful, wonderful. Wonderful, wonderful. Let's check out the chat room and see who we got live on this sexy Thursday night. Let's see. Craig Lee. Brady Ferguson. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Brian Adams. John Tamburino, Ronnie Frampton, forget about it, and Red Red. One, two, three, four, all good to go. So this is what we're going to do right now. It's going to be a quickie stream. So everyone, soak it up. Soak it up right now because this is what we're going to do. We're going to pick the two winners of the Conor McGregor paintings. We're going to look at the... Uh, the entries right now and if you didn't enter you better do it quickly because we're about to pick the winners and then after that, i'm gonna give you my picks for this over here in the living room let's go there boom fight night where are you boom there it is fight night holly Holm versus betch Kohea. i cannot do a fight buddies this weekend unfortunately i will be watching him on sunday but that's fine that's fine because i'll give you my picks today you're gonna get an early pick guaranteed four picks for this boom 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 i'm gonna give it to you I'm going to give it to you hard, and I'm going to give you strong. Right, Connor? Yes, sir. That's right. Connor McGregor, Floyd Mayweather. This is happening August 26th, and I hope you guys are pumped up for that as well. We have some business to take care of right now. Where is my son, Mike? Uh, he's not here yet, but that's okay. Maybe he'll win. Maybe he won't. We'll find out. Ling Ling and Brianna send love to all. Much love to Ling Ling and Brianna. Wonderful, wonderful. Eddie, because 
<laughs> Where's the, that's the peanut guy. We haven't seen him in a hot minute. Now he's Eddie, B, Eddie Because. He says, my name broke, but I'm still the peanut guy. Also, who you got, Floyd or McGregor? I mean, I think everyone's picking McGregor, right? Right? Everyone's picking him? Yes, <laughs> We're going to be talking about that a lot. Conor McGregor, Floyd Mayweather, there is a lot to talk about. If you missed last night's show, definitely run it back, and uh, I give you my quick, instant opinions on what, what's going to go down on August 26th, and we're going to keep it going. We're going to keep talking about it. Tonight, we're going to talk about one Conor McGregor thing, paintings. Let's go over here. Boom. Now, this video over here is Fight Night, Fight Buddies, Lewis versus Hunt, and this is where the entries took place. You had to like the video. Subscribe to the MMA Holes, share this video on social media, and then down below, you had to put a name of a person, a certain Luke Thomas, wonderful, wonderful, and submit your entries down in this section over here. We're going to look who entered their names on this wonderful, wonderful contest. Cue the music. All right, ladies and gentlemen, let's see who we have. Now, guys... The only people that can win have to have the name Luke Thomas in their comments. You're the best over here? That's not a winner. Thank you for saying my name. That's not a winner. Oh, my wife jumped in. She's not. This is just disregard this. My wife is trying to get me the painting. That's a winner. Let's see. Wonderful, wonderful. That's not a winner. I'm Thad's not a winner. Anything that does not say... Luke Thomas, well, that's not a winner. So my response is, if it says your name with a check, it's not a winner. It must say Luke Thomas. It must say Luke Thomas. Luke Thomas, I'll take it. Are you guys ready? Are you guys ready for the contest? I can't hear you in the chat. I need to know. Are you guys ready for the contest? The wife is in the chat right now. And you can't win the painting. I know you want to get me the painting, but you can't win the fucking painting, Christine. So you can't win it. So stop it. All right. So this is how this works. The YouTube randomizer. What I do is I take the link from the top. I copy it. I go to the YouTube randomizer. And I paste it right here. Boom. Like this. Are you ready? And then I hit load comments. And then we do it. Are you ready? Oh my god, the music's back. I'm so nervous. There's two winners to this contest. Two paintings. And I'm gonna pick it. Right now. Are you guys ready in the chat? Hit me with the ones. Oh my god, I'm gonna click it. I'm gonna touch it. Let me hear a McGregor in the chat. Here we go. Dun, 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 dun. And we got 10 more likes. Yes! I've got 10 more likes. I've got 10 more likes. I've got 10 more likes. Fuck you, dislikes. I've got 10 more likes. I've, I've got, got 10 more likes. I've got 10 more likes. I hope the dislikes die of AIDS. Diaper John jumps in <laughs> and ruins the drama. You know what that means? Let's start the music. Are you guys ready? Okay, let's load the comments up. Here we go. <sighs> There's the video right here with the thumbnail. I'm about to pick the first winner of the Conor McGregor painting. That's right, the first picture. I'm so excited. I can hardly... I just thought of something, guys. <laughs> I just thought of something. We need to figure out what painting you're going to get. Okay, so here's the deal. The first winner is going to get the first painting. The winner of this painting right here. The winner of this painting right here. The first winner gets. Okay, you see that? You have to be in the U.S. or Canada. And I will check afterwards if you qualify. Qualify. Here we go. Start the music. <laughs> All right, this is it, guys. 
We're going to do it now. Is everybody ready? Randomly pick the winner. And the winner is... Tommy Arnold. Thanks, brother. Nope. Not a winner. We do it again! All right. Because I can't win, that's me. You ready? Let's do it again. Randomly pick a winner. Brian Adams check. Nope. We do it again. Randomly pick a winner. Here we go. Luke, hot dog bottom lips. Thomas, happy days is the winner of the first painting. Happy days, congratulations, and you are wonderful, wonderful. Wonderful, wonderful. Happy days is the winner. Now, what I'm going to do is after the stream, I'm gonna double check. I need to find out if you have liked the video, if you subscribed to the MMA holes. I know you're subscribed already. So just show proof that you liked the video and sh show proof that you shared it on social media and the painting is yours. So what I'm going to need you to do is send me a message at the MMA Holes. Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, whatever you want to do, DM me, and we'll touch base after the show. Happy days. You are the winner of the first painting. Let me show you. This painting right over here. Conor McGregor looking to the side, swollen sexy. And now we go to the next painting. Conor McGregor smoking the cigarette. Are you guys ready for the second Winner, let's do this. Happy Days wins the first painting. Who wins the second painting? I am on the edge of my seat right now. There are two winners for this. Is everybody ready? Here we go. Randomly pick the winner. And the winner is... Not Brian Adams, because that's me. The MMA holes, we do it again. DVW is in the chat. Does DVW get another prize? Does he win two times in a row? Well, stay tuned, because we're about to find out the second winner on the MMA holes live. Here we go. Randomly pick the second winner. Let's do it. Oh my god, I'm so nervous! Uh -huh. <laughs> Carlos San Pedro says you're the best. There is no Luke Thomas in here. We do it again! <laughs> Alright. Who could it be? Who has the second painting? Happy Days won the first painting. Who has the second painting? Are you ready? Let's do it. Frank Bavon says, wonderful, wonderful, good bants and laughs. You didn't win. We do it again. <laughs> oh, God. Someone shoot me. Randomly pick go. Uh, nope, that's not it. Do it again. Randomly pick go. Uh-oh. We have a winner. I see a winner. We have a winner, right, Luke Thomas? Uh, yeah. Brian Adams, you won the painting. Brian Adams says, Luke drinks Donkey Come Thomas. That is right. That is correct. Brian Adams, who sings that beautiful song. Uh, what's the song that he sings? Um, I don't know. He sings one of those songs. Brian Adams, congratulations. Now you as well need to contact me on social media at the MMA Holes or message me on YouTube. You need to send me a screenshot of the rules. You need to be subscribed. I think you are subscribed. But send me the like and the share. Show me that you liked and shared the video. And the painting is yours, my friend. I need your addresses. And once everything's confirmed, I send it over to our good friend, Ned Nostrils. And we will send the paintings over. Guys, there are two winners right now in the MMA Holes Live. That was super dramatic. I was on the edge of my seats constantly. 
What's going on, Arb Span S P M A uh, Cages? What's going on? I hope you're wonderful, 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 wonderful. So happy days and Brian Adams, correct? Congratulations! I saw Brian Adams was in earlier, and uh, congratulations, my friend, you won, and happy days won as well. We need to get your information, and congratulations to everyone that entered and to everyone that is a wonderful, 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 wonderful. MMA holes. We've got ten more likes. Dan and Ant Tongue Contest wins. Ba da da da. I've got 10 more likes. I've got 10 more likes. I've got 10 more likes. Fuck you, dislikes. I've got 10 more likes. I've got 10 more likes. I've got 10 more likes. I hope the dislikes die of AIDS. That's right. Bing, 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 bing. 20 likes in the tip jar on this wonderful swole, swole, wonderful, wonderful contest giveaway. Happy days and Brian Adams, congratulations. You guys win. Now, there is a correction. There is a correction because it's not a cigarette. It's a toothpick, apparently. But I thought it was a cigarette. Here, let's look over here. Um, anyway, Conor McGregor apparently has a toothpick in his mouth. In this picture, that is Brian Adams' picture. And that is Happy Days' picture. Let's get your information after the show. I will be hunting you motherfuckers down. And uh, the paintings are yours. Congratulations, guys. All right. Ten viewers watching. Welcome to our Thursday show. I hope everyone's good. I see Joey with the numbers. Olympia Lowlife. Uh, Christine's back. Craig Lee. And Matt Salisbury says, hello, Christine. All right. So there is a fight this weekend. I'm going to do a quick, quick, quick pick, pick, pick of what's going on. Four fights. Saturday morning and afternoon. Let's do the picks. Let's get Chris's guaranteed four. For this Now, I said I am not, like, super-duper excited about this card, and unfortunately, I can't watch it. I will be watching it on Sunday, so I will be giving you my review afterwards on... I'll probably be live this weekend. I'm, I always pop up anyway, so stay tuned. Stay by your phones and make sure you have that bell notification ready to go, because I will be live at one point. But uh, we have some, uh, some, uh, some things going on here. Four fights, and I'm going to give you my picks right now. You may receive correct picks is what will achieve. Red beard, light skin, hold your girl tight. It's time for Mystic Monster picks some fights. Every time I pick, I, I get pick. them right. Now take off your clothes and shut the lights. Suck my dick. It's time to pick. Suck my dick. It's time to pick. I see Joe Miller is hanging with the boy. Hanging with the boys. All right, guys. We're going to go through this really quick because I this is how much I give a shit about this car. We're going to go super duper quick. Now, first fight. Safadine versus Dos Anjos. Dos Anjos is jumping up to 170 because he had a tough time cutting the weight. So now he could have a couple more cheeseburgers and hit 170. He's pumped up, fill into his head, fighting a Tarek Safadine. Safadine is no joke. He is a swole, sexy man as well. And his record is 16, 6, and 0 oh versus a 25, 9, and 0. Oh. Dos Anjos abandons his 155-pound division and goes up to 170 after his loss to Eddie Alvarez. Guys, this one is easy for me. I feel confident. I feel comfortable in this one. And I am going to pick, for the win, Dos Anjos. For the win, Safadine, I'm sorry, my friend, but Dos Anjos is going to be nice. He's going to be, has a full belly, and he's going to take care of business. And I do see this fight going super quick. I think Dos Anjos is going to make quick work of Safadine, the number 11 fighter. Let's see what happens, but RDA for the win. Let's go to the next fight. Kim, bink, like this. Oh, fuck, drop shit. Oh, okay. Anyway, sorry about that. All right, Kim versus Colby Covington. Guys, Soul Sexy Fight as well. South Korea, look at his stats. Go through it. Let's look. Bang, big, gigantic head, tall man. And he is six foot two, 35 years old. He doesn't look 35 years old. Three fight winning streak. Tarek it out. Last one's against Safadine. Sound familiar to you guys? Uh, Dominic Waters, Joshua Berkman, and then lost to Tyron Woodley, who happens to be the champ. Let's go back over here. Oh, fuck you, UFC.com. Uh, Cole Covington. They have something in common here because look at this. Three fights in a row. Same fucking thing. Three fights in a row. Let's see who we got here. Brian Barbarena. Uh, what else? Max Griffin. And Jonathan uh, Manier. All right. 
You guys want to know who I'm picking on this one? I'll tell you right fucking now. Because that's what I'm going to do. Now, I did want to pick the number seven ranked fighter here. Five fight win streak. Guy's been looking pretty damn good. I mean, three fight win streak. Pretty Looking pretty good. We have another three over here. It just came down to this. I just want to go to USA. So I'm picking Colby Covington for the win. Those are two for two. I'm going to guarantee you get those picks right and lock it up. Going back here, check it out. Two more fights. Guys, write these picks down because you're guaranteed to win and win a lot of money because I'm Mystic Moss and I get all my picks right. Andre Arlovsky, number eight fighter, 25, 14, and zero. Marcin Tibura. I've been pretty high on this kid from Poland, Belarus. Who do you got? Well, I'm done with Arlovsky. I'm completely done with Andre Arlovsky. Let's look at the stats anyway for shits and giggles. Look through here and there you go. Andre Olavsky, for fuck's sake. The last win was Frank Mir in 2015. I don't give a fuck who you're fighting right now, even though I'm high on this kid. Sorry, Andre, but uh, I don't think you have any shot. Let's look. Let's look at the stats over here. Just for shits and giggles, 15-2 and oh, nasty as fook. Uh, Two-fight winning streak. Yeah, yeah, don't, it's, not even, it's not even a question here. It's not even a fucking question. Give me the Polish man for the win, Marcin. Tibora, Tibora, whatever the fuck you want to say, for the win. Marcin, congratulations in advance. You're going to kick the shit out of Andre Arlovsky. Rest in peace, Arlovsky. Next fight, the main event of the evening, which I've been complaining about this and I have not changed my mind. Holly Holm versus Bech Kohea. Well, who gives a fuck? Who gives a fuck? Who the fuck is that guy? That guy is Holly Holmes. And the other guy is Betch Cohea. Now, Holly Holm does have a nice ass. It's ass versus ass. Beautiful asses in this fight. But, yeah, battle of the, battle of the butts, I guess you could say. Um, I feel pretty confident about this one, too. Now, let's go to Betch real quick. Let's, let's just check out what's going on with, with the Betch, with the crooked nose, the, uh, the dominant male-featured face. <laughs> check it out. I'm going to open this up. Now, this last fight was a draw, and she was fine with that draw. A lot of people were, uh, they were, they were having it, but it was a draw. So, a whole lot of meh. Jessica I was the last win. Raquel Pennington was the last loss. Now, Raquel Pennington has been on a, a decent little run of herself. And then that embarrassing performance against Ronda Rousey. And when I mean emba- I, em- humiliating performance. Now, we go to Holly Holm. We pretty much know what's going on with Holly Holm here. She needs a win in the worst fucking way. Holly Holm was on top of the world, it seems like not that long ago, but if you really think about it, it was. She beat Ronda Rousey November 14th of 2015. November 14th. It feels like yesterday. Of 2015, she was on top of the world. Beat the unbeatable. Everyone was trotting her around, putting the crown on the head, saying, Ronda Rousey, you're the girl, man. You're you're the girl, man. (laughs) You're the girl, man. And uh, she fights Misha Tate. I was at this one, 196. I talk about this a lot, a lot. Now, this was a great fight. Holly Holm, I feel, was winning. Got caught at the end of the fight. And Misha Tate, well, she did Misha Tate and strangled the fuck out of Holly Holm. Holly Holm didn't really tap. She just was about to go to sleep, night-night, and that was it. It was all downhill from there. Next fight, Valentina, the bullet. Well, listen, she did not look good in that fight. They did go to the decision, so kudos for that. And Jermaine Durand to me, a lot of controversy with that fight. I did pick Jermaine in that fight, but a lot of controversy, late hits and blah, blah, blah. Regardless, it's a three-fight losing streak. Now, who does Chris pick? Who does Chris pick? Look at these two young ladies. Chris looks at both of them, and here's the deal. If you guys saw the media, the whole, uh, what is it called? That press conference that they had with all the guys on the dais, all the drama. When Holly Holm faced off with Betch Cohea, well, Holly had a fire in her eyes that I haven't seen in a long time. Holly Holm looks super determined. This is it, Holly. This is it. This is your time. Somehow the UFC gave you that title. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Excuse me. What the fuck? Somehow the UFC gave you a chance to headline another fight. This is a golden opportunity under the big stage. I know it's a fight pass. I know it's on during the day. But still, 
you are headlining this fight. If Holly Holm wins convincingly, no more five round bullshits, takes care of Betch Cohea, well, Holly Holm, she's back in the picture. Holly Holm still's got it, I feel. It's just, she's just, she got knocked down a bit. So who does Chris pick? I know I've been talking a lot about Holly Holm. What if Chris picks Betch Cohea? There's no way Chris is going to pick Betch Cohea. And I don't know why I'm talking about myself in the third person, so I'm going to stop. I pick for the win, Holly, the preacher's daughter, home for the win. Who do you guys have in the chat? Let me know right now inside this phone over here. Let me know who you guys have in the chat and who are you most excited to see in this wonderful, 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 not really a uh, fight night. Let me know right now. Now, remember, guys, I just did the giveaway. If you want to see the dramatics of what happened, well, I'm going to ruin it for you. Because Happy Days and Brian Adams are the winner of the Conor McGregor paintings. And it is wonderful, wonderful. Wonderful, wonderful. Thank you. All right, Jay Smooth, what's up, friend? He's alive. Oh, I remember that pic. The black man in that photo looks like my dad. Oh, you're talking about the Craig Lee <laughs> Does it really look like your dad? Or are you just fucking with us? Our code name science is... Hang with the boys! <laughs> Jay Smooth, hell yeah. He was my homie for real. Mr. Flannery says dick pics. Robin Uli, what's up? The MMA holes absolutely agree. She's there to take her head off her shoulders. She wants her spot back. And she wants it. She wants the meatloaf. She wants it now. Rob, yeah, I think we're on the same page. Team home. Holly for the win says Craig Lee. Mr. Ha Flannery says Holly Holmes. A lot of Holly's homies in the chat. Holly will destroy her. Betch wins. This one easily says forget about it. Mm-hmm. Wonderful, wonderful. Uh, yeah, I don't, I don't know, but hey, the crazier things have happened. Another draw. This is code name science. Uh, imagine if it's another fucking draw. Yeah. Well, I'm gonna be watching it back the next day. Here's my next question for you guys: Who in the chat is watching this fight live, and who will be watching it on a replay? Are you guys getting up to watch this fight? Let me know in the chat. Who is watching it live or, you know, the times are all different. So maybe it's afternoon. Maybe it's nighttime for you. I don't know what time you're watching this fight. But for me, it's super early. For me, it will be, let's see, 8 a.m. Eastern time. For fuck's sake. There's no fucking way. Well, it's, it's crazy. This, I have to go some. I actually, actually have to be somewhere at 8. So there's no shot. But yeah, 8 a.m. Eastern time. Fucking crazy. So that means what? 12 p.m. over here. Uh... God damn, 12 p.m. would be uh, the main card, I'm guessing. Hold on, 8? Wait, when does this start? Uh, let's look at this. It says 8 a.m. Eastern Time, but is that for the prelims? Oh, here we go. I'm a dick. I'm a fucking bag of dicks. So, okay, here we go. Fight, uh, the prelims start at 4.45 a.m. over here. 1.45 a.m. Pacific Time. 8 a.m. And then 5 a.m. for the main card. Well, there you go. So, you know what, though? I can't really complain because here's the deal. Bellator doesn't show the fights in real time. Bellator likes to replay shows and stuff like that. I don't like that. If you're dying, uh, 5 a.m. Western, yikes, yeah, Olympia, right? Uh, if, Bell if Bellator would just do the same thing, like if there's a fight that you really want to see, like on this card, for instance, say you really want to see this fight right here, which is probably the only one I'm really... Look, really looking forward to seeing. I, I actually have interest in this fight. Rafael Dos Anjos, Rafael Dos Anjos versus Tarek Safadine. Now, I want to watch this fight. I got to get my ass up at 8 in the morning and make sure I see it, which is not horrible. But if I'm on the fucking Pacific Times, well, it is fucking horrible because I got to get up at 5 a.m. Who the hell's going to get up at 5 a.m. to watch RDA versus Tarek Safadine? I don't think anyone. I don't think anyone's going to do it. But it is what it is. I need to know, when are you going to watch it? Live or whenever, says Craig Lee. So he's just going to go with it. Holly does a leg kick straight to her dome, says Joel Miller. That sounds wonderful, wonderful. Wonderful, wonderful. Uh, Mr. Flannery, yes, uh, sir. Yes, sir. Here it is. Yes, sir. <laughs> it's nighttime, and I am breeding. 5 a.m. Western, yikes. Ha ha, you crazy man. What's your favorite stuff? Uh, for that about, says Floyd isn't a favorite by nearly as much as he should be. On the betting odds, I think I might bet some money on Floyd. Says Fred. Yeah, you gotta bet a shit. You gotta bet a shitload of money to win, though. Who, why the fuck would anyone put? If you're gonna put money on Floyd Mayweather, you gotta drop at least a G. Like, uh, wh why would you even put money on it? Are you, what? 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 what, 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 what. <laughs> <laughs> oh God! Suns out, guns out. Says Louis Serrano. That sounds wonderful. 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 
Holla Fookers. What's up, Chris? What's up? Grinding in the Shadows is here. And you are wonderful, wonderful. Well, for fuck's sake, there's 20 people watching right now. And I was about to wind this shit down. How dare you guys jump in and spoil my... Anyway, how many of you guys in the chat were here for the tattoo? It's all bloody and disgusting right now, but when it heals up, I'd love to show you guys. It looks good clean. I like it. And I'm, uh, I'm an MMA hole for life. For fuck's sake. That's right. A lot of head movement. I see a lot of fucking head movement. Head movement in the chat. Look at you guys. Head movement! 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 Head movement. <laughs> That's right, guys. This week will be fight night, fight morning, and yeah. So actually, I didn't really see many answers over here. Who is watching it live? I want to see live or not, or live or replay, let me see. Let me see in the chat, live or replay, if you're going to watch it live. Replay if you're going to watch it on a replay. And put nope if you're not going to watch it at all. Three options, live, replay, or nope. Let me know in the chat. What are you going to do about this fight over here? Because we're all hardcore. We want to watch this shit. But do you really want to watch this shit? I need to know right now. I hear Rousey is teaching McGregor his boxing for the first fight. Yeah. Is that true, Connor? Yes, wow. That is true. You heard correctly. Olympia Low Life says, looks great, dude. You were a champ, says Olympia Low Life. Yes. I have a little experience so I could sit there and take it. It doesn't hurt as bad as people think. Tattoos, they're not as, um, I don't know. They're not as bad as you think. The ribs suck. Ribs suck balls and cocks. L ribs could lick my balls. Lick my balls. Uh, let's see. I believe I will. Starbucks opens at 5. I'll bring my iPad and find an out of the way corner. It says East Side Riders. So there you go. Olympia Lice is replay. Louis Serrano says, no fucking way. No fucking way. Uh, the Korean Superdog is injured and out of the fight. Yeah, that's what I heard. Super, super dog. Super dong. Oh, uh, look at this. Joey. Joey with the number says, where's a sexy V-neck? <laughs> with the super chat. Holy shit, dropping the super chats. Joey, you're fucking wonderful, wonderful. That's very nice of you. That is very nice. What the fuck is my super chat? Hold on a second. Streamlabs has been a fucking bitch cunt. Let's see. Here's my MMA holes. Uh, all right, here we go. Tony, welcome to the MMA holes, you fook. I hope you are wonderful, wonderful. Anyway, Joey with the fucking super chat. I don't know where the fucking donation is over here. What's going on with the alerts? Someone's gonna get hurt. Hurt, 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 hurt. That's weird. But don't. thank you very much for the super chat. It's very nice. V-neck is MIA. Someone find V-neck right now. Uh, JSG says replay. I'm in Cali, so I won't wake up at, uh, at 5 for that shit, says Joel Miller. Uh, either way, uh, either one live or replay, says Craig Lee. Codename Science says, uh, uh, will they broadcast the replay on FS1 or no? Is this fight pass fight only? Yes. This is a fight pass fight. And um, it looks like they replay it anyway. But if you don't have Fight Pass, there is always a way. And FS1's been pretty good as of late with the replays. FS1's been really good with the replays. I got to find out why my donation's not working. This is fucking bullshit. What's going on here, donations? What the fuck? Let's see. I don't like that. This is unacceptable. Super chat. Yeah, super chat's here. What the fuck? What the fuck? the fuck let's test it hmm test super chat ah uh, super chat the fuck why is this super chat not working this is a test super chat alert for 50 dollars yeah he didn't give me 50 dollars but what the fuck is joey's joey well much respect oh here we go here it is ready guys i had to play it but here it comes Ah, super chat. Finally, we got Joey's donation through. I was gonna. Where's sexy V neck? <laughs> Where is sexy V neck? That's the question everyone's been asking right now. And thank you again, Joey, for the two dollars super chat making Conor McGregor soar through the clouds. <laughs> oh god. Yeah, that would have fucking drove me nuts if I couldn't get that to work. Anyway. Joey, looking to make him fly. Look at Connor flying. He's a very good flyer. And guys, the donations through that last interview was fucking so funny, man. You guys were killing it. Uh, so, so that's that. Yeah, so if you have Fight Pass, you can get it on a replay. How do I make Carrie fly? Carrie's not flying anymore. We have Connor flying now. Carrie does not fly anymore. She's, she's retired from flying. But she will be rolling. She will be rolling. Damn, donation not working. Give me my money back. Well, now it's working. But unfortunately, I took away... You know what? Let me know in the chat. Would you rather have Carrie fly or Connor fly? 
Let me know in the chat. I have a feeling you're going to vote Connor back into the picture. And I, might, I mean Carrie back into the picture, so I might have to put Carrie back on my super chat. But not everyone knows who Carrie is, so that's why I took her away. No offense, Carrie. You're still plastered all over this swole show. So it is what it is. All right, guys. So there it is. Check it out. Tarek Safadine versus RDA. Next one, Colby versus Dong Hyun Kim. Arlovsky Marson. And Holly Holm versus Betch Koheya. So I am going to be streaming. Now, here's the deal, guys. Today is Thursday. Tomorrow is uh, Friday. And uh, yeah. I'm not sure what's going on. It doesn't look like there's going to be a random night, but stay close to your phone, your computers, and your laptops, or whatever the fuck you're on. Uh, stay very close because I will be lurking. Hit that uh, notification bell next to subscribe so you get the alert and know when I'm on. I can be on at any time because I have this swole phone that enables me to go live whenever I please. So I will be doing some live streaming. Uh, maybe after the job tomorrow night, I'll live stream. Maybe during the day, I'll live stream. You never fucking know. Be prepared for me to arrive. You have my picks. Dos Anjos, Covington, Tibora, and Home. Those are guaranteed. So you're four for four right there because I am Mystic Moss. And I am wonderful, wonderful. Wonderful, wonderful. Thank you, Luke. <laughs> Olympia Low Life says bring carry back. JSG wants carry back. Uh, what do I get for giving $1 million? <laughs> well... For $100, you get the whole group. There's a group of UFC fighters dancing on a stripper pole. Uh, one day, one day, that $100 will be donated, and then I can retire. <laughs> Here's the MMA Holes Living Room. Who should be next on the MMA Holes Living Room? It's a good question. We need to make another swole victim on the MMA Holes Living Room wall. But until then, we'll see what happens. Uh, let's see, lose Diaper John. He is uh, never on the show anyway. He's like, well, here's the thing. You can't lose Diaper John because of this. Wonderful, wonderful. That is Diaper John. So do we get rid of? Wonderful, wonderful. And just use? Wonderful, wonderful. I don't know if it's the same. So Diaper John. Wonderful, wonderful. Might have to stay. Might have to stay. Uh, never, never. Uh, sat, says Craig Lee. Uh, blah, 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 blah. So Saturday morning, uh, yeah, I got a bunch of things going on. But like I said, I, I'm going to try to stream as much as I can. Uh, if it's via phone, it's via phone. But I love to uh, to keep it going. It was actually kind of, what did you guys think of the um, the random tattoo stream? Just for the fact that you guys had a place to just chill and hang out. I thought that was kind of cool. But um, that, that was pretty nice. You know, I see you guys hanging out in there. Jesse Bell Hill, George Sampras, Craig Lee. I even saw Joey Numbers hanging out. That's right. Put John P. Fears on the wall. <laughs> yeah, diaper is wonderful. Wonderful, wonderful. And guess what, guys? We have 10 more likes. Speaking of diaper, John. Everybody dance. I've got 10 more likes. I've got 10 more likes. I've got 10 more likes. Fuck you. Dislikes. Yes. I've got 10 more likes. I've got 10 more likes. I've got 10 more likes. I hope the dislikes die of AIDS. Such a good dancer. Bye, John. See you later, buddy. Peace out. John? John, don't do that. Jo John. Anyway. So we have 10 likes. Look at that, 31 likes on this swole, sexy uh, contest winner show. Happy days and Brian Adams. Where are you guys? You guys are nowhere to be found. But yeah, I'll hunt them down and I will make sure that we get all the information. And we get them their paintings because it is wonderful, wonderful. Uh, one more question before I do go. Uh, in real life is a big thing right now. I noticed Twi Twitch is doing this. YouTube is jumping on the bandwagon. It's all about, it's all about, it's all about the live streaming. Now, I had a vision about this live streaming. I really like the way live streaming works, but now it's like exploded. Katy Perry and all these fucking people are jumping on the live stream bandwagon. Uh, Google Hangouts does a great job with all that stuff. And I think it's the way to go. I think it's, it's, it's entertainment right now. So what I'm thinking is this. When I do get a tattoo, if I get an oil change, if I do something really stupid, maybe we'll just have in real life 
types of live streams just randomly. I'm going to make a playlist of just in real life stuff, just kind of bullshit stuff. I don't know if it's like, I don't know if you could say if it's a vlog. We'll set up shop. We'll hang out. We'll bullshit about MMA and whatever's going on at that time. If you guys do like that stuff, let me know with the ones in the chat and we'll do some more in real life shit because, hey, any excuse to stream I like, I'm into it. It is wonderful, wonderful. There'll be more tattoos and I'll be covering up the side. I have plans over here. It did suck when I was getting a tattoo. My shoulder's fucked up. So holding it in place was worse than actually getting the tattoo. But this arm will be covered. Just like this one. And pretty much my whole body will eventually be covered. So that's that. Uh, what happens if you reach 1390 subscribers again? Well, we play the Fuck Luke Thomas song. That's right. I said 1390. We're two away. So look out for that. Do it, Fook. So Craigley's in. Mike Fitz says, who won? Wonderful, wonderful. Well, you're going to have to go back and watch the video. I'm not telling you. <laughs> <laughs> wonderful, wonderful. That's right. I passed your quiz, though. It did. I had to pass the quiz. My wife failed miserably. Um, I don't think anyone else passed besides George Sampras. But I like the quiz. If you guys like the quiz, um, I like the quiz. So that's all that really matters. So Craig Lee says do it. Olympia says do it. And Joel Miller says do it. So there you go. Three. That's all we need. Right? Olympia life. Uh, let's see. You should uh, go to the movies, theaters, and live stream the movie with us. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I should, right? Wonderful, wonderful. <laughs> I should. That'd be great. That would go over well. Mexican wants to know who won. Mexican, it was you, man. No. 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 Mexican's asking about who won the contest because that that's what this is about. Happy Days and Brian Adams were the winners. It was very dramatic. Very, very dramatic. So if you want to see the dramaticness and uh, yeah. But the good thing about it is at least both of those guys are MMA holes. They are consistent MMA holes. Even though they're not here right now, they are consistent, so I'll give them that. Brian Adams started off a little weird because we had a little troll issue between the two of us. And now he's an MMA hole. Who would have thought? Who would have fucking thought? A couple comments from the chat, and I'm going to wind this fucker down, so get your last thoughts out. If there are two subscribers left that want to get in there, fuck it. We'll play that Luke Thomas song because we said 1390, so we do it. We just do it. That's right. Right, Ellen? That's right. Happy and someone else. Uh, Jay Sue says, put me up on the wall in your living room. It will change your bum life, you bearded fucking goat. <laughs> wonderful, wonderful. Oh, you mean over here? You know what? Yeah, we should put you here. We should put you on here. Uh, Jay Smooth, we should put you on here. But we, we need a reason. We need a reason. And Jay's been pretty fucking good, I have to say. Do a fidget spinner giveaway. <laughs> Do you mean... This one broke, by the way. Where is it? This one here. The bearings came out of the outside. It still fucking spins. But um, the one fidget spinner that I do have... Yes, I'm a grown man with a fidget spinner. The outside bearings broke. But it looks kind of fucking cool. Right? Look at that. You can just stare at it and fall into the trap of the fidget as the fidget spins. Let's see. Fidget spin music. Look into the fidget spinner. Get lost. Inside the fidget spinner. Let me blow your mind as I spin the fidget. Look at it. Look at it spin. Spin away. Lose your soul inside the fidget spinner. All right, stop it. <laughs> Fucking losing my mind. I think the tattoo got, it's the ink is sinking into my brain, I think. Wonderful, wonderful. Anyway. Oh, uh, Fears Man is here. Says, yeah, dude, sub Chris, you are fucking. Wonderful, wonderful. Thank you. Or. Wonderful, wonderful. That's right. Fears Man in the fucking house. Craig Lee says that the MMA Holes Fight Pass is going to a 24-7 network. Really? Is it really? Fight Pass needs a little bit something else. So, um. Yeah, I'd be down for them to have some sort of gimmick. That'd be kind of cool. Olympia Low Life says Jesus. Uh, Joey at the number says MMA holes fidget spinners. Hmm. <laughs> uh, what a gay fucking trend. It really was Martin Guitars. It really was. I don't, I don't understand how someone could put ball bearings, skateboard bearings, inside a fucking piece of plastic and spin it and say, your ADD is cured. Your, <laughs> your autism is gone now. You have no more cancer, and AIDS has been cleared up because of the fidget spinner. It does it all. 
It's a one-stop shop for curing all your ailments. Wonderful. All right, wonderful. we're really losing it right now. <laughs> Faggot spinner. Uh, male rompers are cancer. All right, guys. So here we go. We know who won now. Happy days. Congratulations. Brian Adams, congratulations. Let me hunt you fucks down. And hopefully by the end of this weekend, we could, we could get this party going. I could get all the information to Brian Roger. And, uh, oh, no, not Brian Roger. Brady Ferguson. Sorry. Brady Ferguson. There's a lot of you now. And it's tough to remember everyone's names. It's really weird. I can't multitask. But uh, Brady Ferguson. Brady, Brady, Brady Ferguson. And let's do a little shout out to Brady because Brady is fucking awesome. We're going to go to Twitter. I'm just going to show you. You need to follow my man. Let's go to Twits. Twitter, Twitter, Twitter. Twit, Twit to Twitter. Boom, boom. Okay, let's see. Brady, Brady, Brady. I'll have it in the description, too. Here we go. Let's go like this. Check it out. On the video, the UFC Fight Night, Lewis versus Cunt, you can go to, it says, check out this man's work. Oh, this is his fucking, no, what am I doing? I'm such a dick. Well, this is his YouTube channel. You can go over there and check out his YouTube channel. It's in the link. <laughs> he looks like he just took a nice, healthy shit. Brady Ferguson over there. As well, you can go to Twitter. Let's find my man. La -da 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 -da. It's the motherfucking D O double G. La -da 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 -da. Why can't I open my fucking DMs in his mother? Let's go like this. Brady. Here he is. His <laughs> that picture's the best. Uh, at Fork F O R K A S O N. Go follow my man. 101. Let's get him up to a G. A cool G. There's his dog. But he put a picture up. This looks like it's going to be the next one that he's looking to get, give away. Conor McGregor, big burly chin, big burly mouth. And uh, yeah, check that shit out. It is wonderful, wonderful. That will be, uh, it looks like that's what he's doing next. I don't know. He's got a lot on his plate. He's got some cool stuff over here. Let's see if he put anything else on his bitch. Uh, <laughs> let's see what else. Did he do this? Fucking around with some paint today. Look at his shit. He's just fucking around. Look at his shit, man. God, I wish I had half this guy's talent. Guy's fucking good, so definitely give him a follow. And thank you very much for, well, this looks like Rocky Dennis, Conor McGregor. <laughs> oh, that's cool. Little, little Diaz action. There's Einstein. He's fucking good, man. He's got some good skills. There's Mac again. He's got some cool detail, man. Brady Ferguson at Fork Asan. Uh, is that a toothpick? Fuck, I thought it was a cigarette for some reason, but yeah, he's right. Or it could be a match. I don't know. But there's Conor McGregor. And that's the one Brian Adams won. Congratulations, Brian Adams. Joey Diaz. Pretty fucking cool, man. Iron Mike Tyson. It's legit. Check it out. Who the fuck is this guy? Tommy Chong. Well, there you go. I knew that. I thought it was Christopher Lloyd for some reason. <laughs> wonderful, wonderful. Joe Rogan. And Christopher Lloyd. <laughs> oh, and Back to the Future, maybe. Anyway, you, you get the deal. Go check him out. Brady Ferguson. He is wonderful, wonderful. And once again, his handle is at Fork. F-O-R-K-A-S-O-N. That's right, MMA Holes. Thank you for watching this wonderful, 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 wonderful. Swole show. Wow, we're one subscriber away from the Luke Thomas song. We're so fucking close. I'd hate to end the show now. I'd hate to end the show now, but I'm going to have to because it's the end of the show. Thank you guys for watching. I do appreciate all the love and support as usual. Putting 13 swole in that jar is wonderful, wonderful. Wonderful, wonderful. So it is what it is, guys. Thanks for watching. Uh, keep the conversation going. When these streams shut down in the comments section, well, you just keep that conversation going. I do read all the comments. I come back in there. So if you do need a place to talk, you can hang out in the comments section afterwards. And it's like a friendly hangout for us. Um, as well as I have the website up, but what I'm trying to do is make it the MMA holes.com. I have all that shit and it is wonderful. Wonderful. Oh my God. Look at this shit. Hold on a second. The dude <laughs> four, 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 six, four. If that is the dude. Well, Hey, thanks man. Because now we can do it. Now we can be wonderful. Wonderful. Now we can play the fucking song. We have the amount of subscribers that we need to do it. Check it out. Living room. Oops, no, it's not that. But check out the chat anyway. 1390! Holy shit! Uh, for some reason, I'm really excited for this one. One, two, one, two, one, two, three.
to fuck you. That's right. Let's do it. Yeah. yeah. It's a little loud. Here we go. Luke Thomas song. Let's do it. Widow's peak. Stupid yeah. hair. That's your opinion. I don't care. I can deadlift. I, I can squat. My inverted the dude. looks like a twat. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Luke Thomas, you the bag of dicks. You did it to dude. Hot dog bottom lip. Never smiles. Serial killing ears. YouTube live streams. Never reads chat. Fuck you. Luke Thomas, you the bag of dicks. Fuck you, Luke Thomas, fuck you, Luke Thomas, Luke Thomas, he a bag of dicks. The dude did it, the dude did it, he put it in there, he stuck his name in there, and we have 1390, we're so close to 1400, we do it another 10, we do it again, Luke Thomas song, thank you guys for subscribing, you guys are awesome, you guys are wonderful, 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 wonderful. right Luke? Wonderful, wonderful. Everyone, don't remember, don't remember, do remember. D what what am I saying? Anyway, congratulations to the winners. Happy days, Brian Adams. Congratulations to you guys. Guys, have a great night. I will see you shortly and soon. And always remember, don't be an a-hole. Be an M-M-A-hole.